Police finally caught up with a burglary suspect overnight. 30 year old Russell Sipe is accused of breaking into the office of Workout Anytime on Maple Leaf Drive this, this spring. WKYT's Victor Puente talks to the gym's owner who says what Sipe did while in the office helped them identify him as a suspect. Today was the arraignment for a man charged with breaking into the office of this gym six months ago. The owners tell me that even if he hadn't been caught on surveillance video, he left an electronic trail. Was almost impossible to miss. Owner Eric Cowden says the crime happened around 2 a.m. on a Sunday back in March while the gym was open to members, but no one else. He believes 30 year old Russell Sipe used an old gym card to get inside. It looked like somebody actually let him in the front door because he had been a past member. Once inside, police say surveillance video showed Sipe checking the doorknobs of every room in the gym. Ends up breaking into our office in the back. We had some chains and, and credit card, but we don't keep any cash on the facility. His arrest citation says he also got onto the gym's computer and never logged out. What he did do, which was wonderful, is he decided to sit up on Facebook and leave his Facebook page open and tell his buddies on instant message that he's breaking into workout anytime, trying to steal whatever he could find. Police located Sipe last night near Liberty Road and charged him with third degree burglary. At his arraignment this afternoon, his attorney said he was currently in treatment and taking Suboxone. He asked Judge Pamela Goodwine to lower Sipe's bond so he could continue his rehab. Cowden says Sipe never bothered the other members who were working out at the time, but they have panic buttons if there had been an issue. When you're 24 hours a day, that's a priority. The judge did lower Sipe's bond to $500. He'll also be required to wear an ankle monitor while he's out on bail. In Lexington, Victor Puente, WKYT. Police say Sipe was in the gym for about two hours.